look at how one woman is helping people change gears in this economic environment. Steve? Well, how several years ago, Marcy Morrison found herself on the wrong end of that pink slip from Qualcomm. Now she's an author, a career coach, and loving what she does, which is helping others make that difficult career change. The line of applicants stretched around the block last month at this job fair for a new downtown motel. And with good reason, the California unemployment rate is at a 12-year high. Job market's tough, and people are looking for any edge. This website might be one. It's part of Marcy Morrison's strategy for finding a new job, or maybe a new career. I do one-on-one -on -one sessions, I do workshops, I do speaking engagements, I do media appearances. She counsels job seekers to look within themselves first. Uh, the first thing I have them look at is what are they really passionate about doing and what are their strengths? Because I find if you put those two things together, people get really energized and enthused and it's better, easier for them to market and sell. Confidence is important, but so is having the right skills. They may even need to do, uh, maybe take an extra, extra class to strengthen their skill set. They may need to put together a portfolio that really shows their strengths and a, a, a make sure that they can go into any situation, like you said, and give a fast spin on how, how they can add the most value to a company. Finally, she says, don't spend all day on the computer or on the phone. Do your research, reach out to your personal network, and set a weekly goal. The last tip is I tell people it's great to find your passion, market and sell yourself, have your support team, but if you don't have a plan and you're not organized, it's never going to happen. Now, of course, nothing is foolproof, but it is rare that a new job just drops in your lap. You usually have to work pretty hard to get a chance to work. Live in the newsroom, Steve Fiorina, 10 News. Thank you, Steve.